Hello, I am making a review of my, well, I'm filming a review of my World War II, um, hang on a sec, sorry, Caro Amarto, or something, Italian World War II tank, so, yeah, I made this looking at a picture, oh, I really, like, built one section, for example, the treads, I built the tracks first, um, and I looked at the photo again, with the other side, then I tried, I was, I was actually trying to figure out what I could, how I could make this for a while, and I finally came up with an idea. Um, okay, so let's get started. Um, so the Carl Mardo tank is a Italian, um, World War II light tank, um, I don't know if you know this, but I only seen one review of a Caro Amardo. Well, not really a review, but um, it's Lego Guys 8 through 0, um, second entry into Country Break 39's, um, no Brick Customs. Um, uh, sorry for your background noise. Um, contest. Okay. Now let's get started. So first, two scale to a minifigure is actually pretty bad. Um, scales. It's like gigantic. Mm -mm. Try my best to get a good scale. It's officer. Sorry, this, if it's dark, this is the lightest place in my house at the moment, I guess. Where there's no noise. Okay. So, yeah, that's what it looks like. Two scale, two minifigure. Let's get the minifigures off and start off with the actual Carl Amaro. Wait, what? Yeah. <laughs> um, so, yeah. There's not much to review off this be on this vehicle, but there are some details. Like here, this is you can actually like to open. Because it's like the view for the driver to see out into the open. And then, um, the treads is like, the treads, like, oh, just an accessory that fell off. The treads are, they straight on the bottom, goes up like that. And then, goes like that. Okay, now the turret. The turret is actually, um, I think it's a pretty cool design. Um, let's just take it off. It's only attached by turn table, uh, turn table. I mean, like, three. There's, like, three down there. Including the one at the top. Here's the turret. I think the design is very nice, if I do say so myself. Oof, too close. If you look at a Carl Mardo picture from a certain website, which I'm not going to tell you which it is, for that reason. <laughs> if you look at I tried my best. Like, if you look at a picture, um, the Carl Mardo tank, it has, like, a thick barrel up here. Then it, like, slants. If you get what I, if you understand what I mean, it's like this. It slants up, and then there's another in the turret. And there's like the actual like stick part of the barrel that comes out. Stick like part of the barrel that comes out. Um, so yeah, um, that's the front. Excuse me for the moment. Okay, now if you look, if you look at the back, it's pretty plain. Um, I was going to add an exhaust, exhaust, but. Yeah, I don't, I don't know what happened to that. So on the back, there's just a standard, like, a brown backpack. It's bent a bit. A DP-28, then a DP-28 mag. If you don't know, it's supposed to be a mine. I came up with this idea a while ago. I didn't make a video of it. To use a mine, a DP-28 magazine, as a mine. 
and Allied Bricks, which I love his videos very much. Um, uh, he also came up with this idea, so I decided to add it on, like actually make a video with it. I don't know. I'm probably gonna put this in a mocker too or something. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much the end of the review. So yeah, that was my World War II Caro Amaro tank review, Italian tank review. So yeah, next up I do not know what it is. I, next vehicle I don't know. But yeah, please like this video and subscribe. Um, goodbye.